So, can I ask, should the Finnish PM have said sorry about the photo of the topless guests in her house? So, you will have seen uh, all of these videos that went viral. The Finnish Prime Minister, uh, Sanna Marin, apologised because there was a photo that came out of this party she was at with two topless guests. That was taken at her official re- residence. And uh, these were just influences that were at the party. But also, she was getting a lot of flack for, um, for you know, dancing, singing, having a good time. And uh, she took a drug test to show that she was clean. Uh, and people are angry that Sajila, what what is is there something wrong with politicians in their free time having a party? But you know what? Like you've got Biden, he's too old. Uh, Sauna, she's too young. Uh, what's our one? Trump? What? No, no, what's his name? Uh, Boris. Boris. Boris is yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, quickly, I he's so <laughs> nearly out the door that you've already forgotten. His oh, name already now. Forgot. He's dead to me. Dead yeah. to me. Uh, yeah. I mean, obviously, he was like a philandering. Didn't know how many children he had, and he was a you know compulsive liar. <laughs> but the thing is, you guys pick. You chose these. You voted for them. But, but, so you can't, you know, kind of have a moan that, oh, well, that she's like, she's 36 years old. She's doing what 36 years old people do. Her name's Sauna, named after the, the you know, the, the most popular pastime in, in Finland. And they, do they or do they not have naked sauna in Finland? I, I, don't, right? I wouldn't naked know. Naked sauna, this is a thing. They, they, they're very body so it's you know, friendly. Thing. Yeah, it's a cultural thing. Well, look. And she's at a party. And in fact, the photo was taken of her, uh, of two people in the toilet downstairs. She's 36, two girls kissing each other. So what? Yeah. You know, we've all had a bit of kissed a girl and maybe liked or didn't like it back in the day. <laughs> <Like a> confession. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's a confessional show. I like that. No, but Lewis, what do you think about that? Because I kind of think, you know, if she was doing something really bad that undermined her and her policies, like Justin yeah. Trudeau in blackface, right. yeah. I think that's pretty bad, but he got away with it. He got voted back in, didn't he? But, you know, that, that I think, is, if it's relevant to you... But she, she's allowed to have a party. I don't think she is. No, she isn't, because I think fin- Finland... <laughs> no, because Finland forgets where their geography is. They, they're right next to, um, to Russia. And, and? And Russia's a very... I, I don't know whether you've heard what's going on with Russia. No, I have, but I'm, and, I'm, 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 and, I'm and struggling country. to see the relevance to the... She shouldn't have a party because she, she, Russia's next door. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she shouldn't be so young and beautiful and having a good time when... when Isn't that what it is? Yeah. Aren't people just jealous I, I that she's enjoying are, herself? I agree. They, I think people know? are jealous. And also, actually, maybe you have a point, Lewis, because I remember when I was a student, there used to be a bus of pensioners. I don't know why I did this, but I just would lift my top up and like, when they, the bus went past, so it stopped people <laughs> their tracks and like <laughs> maybe i might have you know they might pop their clocks who knows like i don't know wow. i feel really bad now it's all it's all it's, it's all, all coming out tonight I feel really bad now. but that could happen in russia yeah. like russia goes to invade and then you know Sawyer yeah. and her mates so just go woohoo and then yeah. everybody stops i think Gina it could confessing work. to flashing now this is like amazing <laughs> i know that is amazing i'm yeah. feeling I'm, every single time i'm with sigil i tingle <laughs> I tingle. is that wrong can i say that i tingle? You can say whatever you want clearly i can say that I, is, is that is that russia is a is a threat and, and, and I think Finland has done an amazing job of sort of negotiating Russia all those years when yeah. the Russians were really the Russians. Now they've proven they're not really the Russians anymore. And, uh, and, and they, they need to be... Re- I'm still struggling, Lewis. So she's, having, she's having a part. Do you think Vladimir Putin is checking out her Instagram and thinking, well... I think Vladimir Putin is looking and saying, you know what, if I can attack a country, am I going to attack some crazy Jewish comedian who's in charge of the Ukraine, or am I going to attack Finland? The next, Finland's next to go. Wow, OK, he's made it a very dark conversation all of a sudden. It really wasn't. It was meant to be a light segment, Lewis, to start yeah. the show. But no. First of all, second thing people forget about Finland is that Finland has a reputation for people not having a good time. Yeah. And, and I told I think I mentioned, maybe Matt, I don't remember when I mentioned this, but back in the day, they did, like 30, 40 years ago, they did a TV thing in America about how doer the Finnish people were. Well, clearly they're not. But that, yeah. maybe that's why people are upset, because, you know, that she's breaking yeah. stereotypes. She's busting out of the mould. Good for her, I say. Just have a... Yeah, yeah why not? Agree. Why can't... Agree. Like, like, Agree. Politicians in their downtime should be... I think they should be able to have as much fun as... It's none of our business. If she's not breaking the law, I think it's mm. not... Anyway.